Welcome back for some more wind blown. As you can see, I'm in the second biome here. Um, I had a little bit of a technical issue and uh, yeah, so I had to restart, but we're, we're here and we're going to do from here because this is an alter attack build I've got going. I have alter attack damage 40%, chained alter attack deal 60% damage. This is kind of nice. Weapon hits replicated, uh, dealing 5% of the original damage. That's kind of nice. Um, we have critical hex. So if we do crits, we're going to do more damage. And then we have Alter Tax Activate Rush. So, yeah, I was going to scrap this. But I really, really want to do this, this build. I don't want to cancel the run. So I'm not going to. I, I prefer to do full videos, but uh, yeah, I didn't realize till I got here that I was dealing with some issues. So. Oh, wait. So we got this boomerang, which I've never shown off. The hope here is that... Um, I think I want... The nice thing about the boomerang is you can literally do that, right? You can just go crazy with it. It's easy to chain, I guess is what I should say. Because the second you recall the boomerang, it uh, it gives you your alter attack up. Which is kind of nuts. So we're hoping to get our hands. There's one more thing that I know is alter attack related. And I want it. It's done. Isn't that awesome? That is that is quite the combo. Hopefully we can get the win. I don't even want to switch my weapons that much. Maybe switch off the uh what is it, the Sirocco? Maybe you could switch that off, but the boomerang, I could see me run it the whole the whole way. Might sound crazy because it's a low level weapon. But it's it's damn good. Yeah, we can just spam those, which is kind of awesome. I guess it'll be a bit of a shorter video, especially if I die. Um, Upgrade the freeze. Sure. So I already bought one gift slot. I did buy one uh, for 600. One thing that's a bit tricky about um, running this one, I find the uh, boomer or the boomerang's alter attack, is that it is one that you can get hit while you're in the middle of running it. Detonado death orb. Um, I mean, this could be really good. I'll put that on there. Ooh, you know what? I'll do it. I'll, I'll I'll pop a potion. You got to do it. Can't pass up those opportunities. Oh, that's a beautiful combo. Now you're not getting in the build. I love that we have the rush activated. I shouldn't have done that. That wasn't very smart.
Yeah, we just have to be careful about the, um, about trying to chain those because we aren't invulnerable when we pop up that, uh, the one. Let's just go here. Money isn't really something you need to worry about because we've already got six kill slots. Which is crazy. So we've already got that. Yeah, so I like that because I can literally just bring it in. And we have the rush on there. It stuns. Damage, we go the HP. We're up to 200 now. What do we got? Oh, we got to try it. I don't know if we're going to have the damage for this, but we got to try, right? Probably not. If I had to guess, I'd say that we don't have the damage required for this. But maybe. Got it? We got it. I never get those. Wow. Okay, 250 health is kind of nice. When you get beat up as much as I do. Do I need the money? Oh, fine. We'll take it. I often pass that up. Yeah, we can just kind of spam this combo. Okay, no, we can't. Oh, that was bad. There we go. Beautiful. I'm a little rusty. I take a day off every week. Um, I take Saturdays off from gaming entirely, and then I come back to record videos on Sundays, and I'm way worse than I was the day before, if that makes sense. Boom. Hit him with that. I had to panic. Sometimes you just gotta panic and run. Now that doesn't hit hard, right? Like that would be one downside. Is that it doesn't hit incredibly hard. But we could get our hands on something that does a little bit more damage. Um, what, was, what was very nice was a, a commenter actually pointed out to me that I was misunderstanding the way that the um, numbers work on the... for each individual weapon, I guess you could say. For the altars. And it makes sense that it works the way it does. I just hadn't really... I just hadn't really thought about it. So, I hadn't really thought about this. But yeah, so the plus 30% is actually just going to give 30% damage buff on this thing, right? This is giving plus 60 on this one. So neither one of them is huge. Um, I don't really care about any of this. Roll it. After being shattered, the team's freeze stays active. He'll spawn every 500 base damage. Activate rush. I mean, that's kind of fun. We probably won't keep it. But anyway, so I um, don't know how well this will go against future bosses or anything like that, but we'll see. The boomerang definitely doesn't give you a nice, like, uh, 
a nice a nice jump in damage, but you can get those altars off like crazy. We have this. Oh, I gotta buy you. We have to buy that. Um, Bonds of Scythe. Finisher damage plus 60. Do I want that? I mean, I could. I'll do it for now. It's gonna do significantly more damage than it was doing. If you're still here at this point of the video, thank you so much for watching. And if you haven't liked the video, it helps a ton with the algorithm. Yeah, that's actually, that actually was, I think, hitting for double. Oh, wow. Okay. Attack speed up. So you can like the damage modifier is even up too, so it does more GPS and then it's adding more. So we're we're we're, we're getting there. That's okay. But we could we could get a heavier hitting weapon. If we do, it'll be it'll be nice. If there's if we if we got like this with a heavy blade or something that might be kind of neat. Maybe. The rush off of that is no joke. Bad combo. I've never actually done a run with this combo. I do think though that we could we could find ourselves something that smacks a lot harder. Oh crap, I got stunned. Didn't see that coming. Yeah, I don't even care about my damage that I'm doing with that. That's not what we're doing it for. Give us a fish. Okay. Okay. All right. This could be better than this. I think it is better. Got the big crit damage. Deep bolt with that could be fun. I think we do it. It hits harder. I know it has less of a, a boost for, for this, but let's, let's go here. Let's try this combo out. Boomerang's pretty cool. I do think that I could maybe get it. Oh, we got I, I literally ran away from a chest. I do think I could maybe get a beat bolt combo going. Um, we go here. We try to get... Oh, yeah. Yeah, like that hit for 1300 damage. Everything's dead. They're all dead. Okay, I just got hit. What the hell? <laughs> Um, it's a no on all of these. I'm going to save my money. So I call these affixes, the things on the bottom there. You can call them whatever you want. But this thing has one where it's, I feel like it's rare. Um, it handles the perfect timing for you. So it's always perfect. It just does, I think, 40% less damage or something like that. But let's be honest. It's okay if it does less damage. Because you'd be critting every single shot with it. That's nuts. Um, we go damage. 
And I feel like you could just stand at range and take everything out. I, I haven't actually uh, been lucky enough to get it on a run to show it off, but I think it could be. I think it could be the one. You know, I think it could be it could be my favorite. Now, if you can get Echo with this combo, everything is dead. If we get Echo. Like, literally everything is completely destroyed if we can get Echo. Oops. What do you got? 60% damage against good enemies? No. Keep that crit damage. Oh, well, I could have shocked those dudes? Okay. Uh, kill all enemies without taking damage. We can try it. Right? Give it a shot. Man, I'm not getting the one that I want. I don't want to re-roll, really, but I... Well, I'll roll once. Those create an explosion. No. I'm not even worried about chaining these things together. That's the honest truth. I don't care about chaining them. Don't need to. Crits, more damage. The trinket filling would have been nice too at 18%. can't beat that. No, we don't need that. Now, I imagine on high difficulties, these combos likely fall off. Um, you know, they, they very likely do. I'm willing to spend 250 bucks just to heal up a bit. And then I'll go and get hit immediately and my uh, health that I just gained will be pointless. If I could get Echo on this, we, we'll be uh, laughing. Um, we go damage. I don't have a fish, so this is going to be a real fight. You can beat this guy without him even getting an attack off if you have like a... If you have a couple of like one of the... Like the gobble fish or the bouncy fish. You can literally melt this dude. That's not going to be our story here. Oh boy. Didn't stun, didn't stun. I didn't handle it great. I'm used to I'm used to completely deleting them, that's why. Um No. But we didn't use a potion and that's the main thing there. A little swim. What do we have? Telepike. This is one that I haven't played a lot with. Oh my god. Plus, it'd be plus 60% attack speed. That's kind of nuts. What do we got? Protection? No. 
Frost Nova spawns a scythe. Heals damage over time. Ooh, that's kind of nice. I kind of like that. It's not a ton, but we're going to spawn... That, that, that's some damage, though, right? Because it does its base damage. And then it spawns a scythe for 8 seconds. And then it does 22 DPS while it's on. That's kind of that's kind of awesome. The Incubator. Now, this is harder now that it's working, I believe, as intended. <laughs> it's kind of funny to say that, but I... Now that it's working as intended... Um, it's a hard no from me. So, before... Maybe in my last video, you didn't have to break these... You never had to. You could just... You could just run through and ignore them. And I thought something was off. And it was. This combo's nuts. 1,400 damage. Anything back there? Oh! There we go. Check all the nooks and crannies. But we only have to worry about clearing those out when there's when we know there's a chest nearby, right? Like, you don't have to take them all out. Boom. Well, that's not good. Hey! What we got here? Now, this could be a mistake. This will be a tough fight, actually. Because we'll get a boost, and then we're going to have to win a fight against a, a tough enemy. Um, we go crit damage. Oh, he's a tough enemy, all right. Look at that health. You just won't die. There we go. I'll say it was worth it. Hopefully we can get some healing before we get to the boss. That was that dude had some HP. You know, we're hitting for like a thousand oh geez, you're back. I didn't want this. Not again. Anything but again. Oh crap. Oh, jeez. So, yeah, that would be the downside to this weapon, I guess. Would be the whole you can get hit in your thing. And that makes you, uh, makes things a little bit trickier. Don't like that I used a thing. Uh, damage up, attack speed up, but damage down. So, just attack speed 40%. Is what you're telling me. Um, see, like this could be fun. I suck. I, 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 I'm not. I gotta do some runs. I gotta do some runs and force myself to get really good with the melee weapons. I just have to. We could do this though. We get get that attack speed up. It, really, it's only giving us a little bit more. We'll go here. We'll run the boomerang build. What the hell?
What level is this? Four? Eh, it's not terrible. At least we got the... I feel like that is such a awesome combination. It's not going to work well against the boss, probably. What are you? Focus trinkets. Something I've never done. Go HP. I've never done anything with focus. I don't think I've ever even put it in my build. Okay. You don't need to, you don't need to break these. We're fine. I always like to read the different affixes on there because I there's going to be some that we that I've never seen before, right? Sometimes they got nothing in them. Sometimes they have bombs in them too. You got to be careful of that, right? What the hell? Oh, jeez. I'm, I'm I'm down behind it. I wouldn't hate it if... Oh. I wouldn't hate it. I got another one of these rooms? This could be bad, man. Oh, jeez. You have to do it. We go health? Or damage? I'm going health. Okay, I know your story. I know what you do. I know you do a zippy, zippy, zip. But we can stun you into oblivion. We're good. Oh, jeez, and he drops bombs. Okay. <laughs> oh, hi. That's not cool. That's not cool at all, man. That was not cool. I'll take the damage this time. Just drop me right on top of an enemy. I see you. I see you. I don't mind dealing with this dude. Generally. I'm not careful. I'm gonna die. There we go. You're dead. Now what about you? Nothing. Yeah, getting health potions or something out of those occasionally, like super rare, would be nice. I'm a, maybe a bit alone on that. But I'm not I'm not a masochist. You know? I don't mind the challenge. But oh my god, do I ever like it sometimes when I can just, you know not be constantly in trouble. Okay. Um, that could make it so that I could backfire, couldn't it? That's fine. I don't know if we're going to have the damage for the boss. Kill all enemies without taking damage. It's probably just one dude. That wasn't bad. Nothing on altars. Um, roll it once. Oh, I sold it. Whoops. <laughs> I, meant to, I meant to roll it. You know what? It's fine because I, I, if we get a shop here, which I think you do. That's, that's kind of nice. 
Yeah, I think there's a shop down here. If we, if and when we kill this this uh, dick, I'm gonna let my stuff charge up. You're coming. This little guy's coming for me. He's looking for some. Yeah, you can. You can just be gone. So yeah, to get that chest, we have to break you. Of course. Of course. You had to have someone in you. Alright, that's okay. Uh, if the hell jump hits, gain opportunity to launch a stronger one. Okay, that would be really cool, wouldn't it? That would be really cool. I'm not doing it, but that's a really cool one to see. I'm not switching up the build now, but that that's kind of that's kind of nice. I could have went down that other path too, for you. Scythe, no. We buy our potion, and we see if we can get the win. We never got a fish. Go a whole run and not see the fish. That stinks, eh? Oh, no! And I'm not 100% sure that we are going to have the build. That this is a winning build. I gotta remember those. They jump out, you immediately have to... You you pretty much immediately have to be on your guard the second that they come at you. Pop a heal. hate you. Okay. We got another one down. Now, this is going to be tough. If we had a fish, you would... We'd be in the clear. I would have saved my fish for this. It'd do a huge chunk of damage. He avoided that. Are you kidding me? Dude. Oh, no, 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 no. Shoot. Oh, geez. Okay, at least we got that off. I can't be the only person that feels like Echo is the most busted thing in this game. We got him. 10,000? <laughs> wow. Okay, well, we pulled it off. We got the win. I got to do melee build next, um, but that was fun. I wanted to show the boomerang off because it was one of my favorite weapons. The second I got it, I was like, I love this weapon. We got the goodies. Ooh, that was kind of fun. Wow. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you want to see more Windblown, make sure to subscribe to the channel. I'll catch you on the next one. Have a fantastic day.